Hello, welcome to a Tabletop Bellhop Cardboard Coat Check. I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop, your cardboard concierge, working with you to make your game nights better. All right, we've got something slightly out of the ordinary for us today. I am about to crack open and unbox a game that I have been meaning to get a copy of for years. Um, but what's weird is it's it's not our usual type of game. Usually we talk about more heavier Euro-style games or cooperative games, deck builders, things like that. No, tonight we have a toyetic, um, gimmicky party game. The thing is, I played this game years ago and adored it and loved it, uh, thanks to a local gamer, John Salila. And now, thank you to The Op, I now have my own copy. So The Op did provide us a review copy of Tapple, which I'm going to be opening up my copy tonight. No other compensation was provided. Um... So Tapple is a speed-based puzzle game with a very cool big plastic piece that is a main feature of it, and that's going to be the main thing I'm showing off. Now, I will give you fair warning. It has been more than 10 years since I played Tapple, uh, possibly even longer than that. It might have been, oh, it might have been 20 years at this point. It's been a long time, and I did not refresh my memory on the rules. So I might be a little bit off on this, and I may mess up how exactly the, the toy works in this game. But either way... First thing to do before we can play and show things off is crack this box open. So let's switch to the other camera and get a copy of Tapple opened. All right, so there's no shrink wrap on this one. This is how it came direct from the op. There is a bit of tape here. So here's your various sides of the box. They say Tapple on them. Um, this is for ages 8 plus, 2 day players, 10 to 20 minute play time. Again, this is from the op or USAopoly. And we are just going to grab a hobby knife. All right, so the top of the box is what opened. So I'm going to sit here, and we're going to slide this out. That's it. The rest is cardboard box. What I'm wondering is, do I even need this box once we get going? Okay, I guess this is odd. Why have, like, folded up instructions when they could have just been there? All right, let's 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 leave this half hidden. It's, it's like a, a secret bomb kind of thing so here it is the quick start guide like is there a non-quick start guide like the complicated version so what you do is you choose a category then the first player starts taps the timer then names an answer mountains presses the letter taps the timer and then passes to the next player so you got 10 seconds to name press and tap or you're out last player standing wins that is tapple it is hot potato with words Okay, there's the full rules. So it goes into the details of the full rules and how to replace the batteries and everything else. They didn't even bother with color rule book because it's a party game. Um, and then there's some important battery information, blah, blah, blah. Okay, then we have a nice little QR code. Hey, go visit the op, check out their stuff. Or even better, follow our link in the show notes to the op in the, in the notes because we are a affiliate of the op. And if you purchase anything from them, we get a small kickback that costs you nothing. All right, so here's the tapple thing. It kind of looks like a UFO. Oh, there was extra piece of cardboard underneath. Oh, brilliant. See, what I'm trying to figure out, I'm like, where where are the cards? So this is pretty brilliant. I, I There's probably people laughing at me now by being like shocked by tapple and like, oh, cool. Tapple did a cool thing. But you know what? Tapple's new to me in, in a way. It's been so many years. So when you flip it over, look at this. There are the cards. Oh, there's a little unpackaging we got to do here. We got to cut the shrink on these which I'm going to try to just tear it off. And when that fails, I will go back to the hobby knife. Oh, and I'm like, it's so close. I can feel. There we go. So let's 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 flip the tapple so anyone watching can see the tapple because it's cooler looking. Oh, you know what? We should put probably put this back on. I have no idea if this came with batteries. Let's turn it on. We'll find out if there's batteries in there. Good to know. All right, so here are the cards, and it's really simple because you just get two categories, and this is where either something green or cartoons. Cosmetics and toiletries or something scaly. Yeesh. Reasons to celebrate or street names. Even better, two-sided. Cars and trucks or something yellow. Going back to the other cards, other side of that one, retail stores and sports. Pet names or pizza toppings. Oh, that's a nice one. I dig pizza toppings. Now, the other thing you can do, and which is how I played this game, 
is we played it just with the player who last won naming a category and got to play fun things like Thundercats characters. So here you have it, the thing for Tapple. Okay, some of them already pressed down. How do I get them to reset? All right, so we're going to sit here. I'm, 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 I don't know what I'm going to do. Here. I, no, I'm going to embarrass myself. I'm not actually going to pick a category. So to start, you're going to hit this, slide this some direction. Oh, I can't figure it out. Terrible. Okay, it is possible it does not come with batteries. All right, we're back. Um, important note to parents, if you get your kids a copy of Tapple for Christmas morning, uh, make sure you open it up and put batteries in it before um, they get up in the morning and try to play with it and it doesn't work. So here we have Tapple, here we have categories. Um, I didn't remember this thing taking batteries. I, I remembered it being a, a mechanical toy, like with springs and stuff that counted down on their own. So I guess it takes batteries. I don't, it might've always taken batteries. I don't remember. So what would happen is I would reset everything. It'd be my turn and I try to name Thundercats. I'd be like, see, it starts counting. Oh, Lion-O. Now I would pass it to someone else. Oh, see, when I hit it, it didn't even stop the first time. Do people hear that? Can you hear the boop and the and the 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 things tapping? And then you just do that to reset it. So that's it. So it did require a a um, Phillips screwdriver to open up a small, you know, jeweler screwdriver to open up. Um, and then it took two AA batteries, which I'm sure it says somewhere on the box. I do love this though that these go underneath and snap right in there. And you just push it back, and when you're ready to play Tapple, you're just like, I need to name, I don't know, ice cream flavors. Uh, vanilla, no, there's no V, chocolate, okay. And now I'd hand it to someone else. But like, I thought the timer's supposed to stop in between, that's what's confusing me. But anyway, I haven't read the rules. I'm gonna let it actually, you know, count down. See, I, I thought I remembered these slowly counting down, and oh, I'm out. See, these pieces, I thought slid. I, I was totally lost on this one. So here you have um, an unboxing of Tapple, which completely blew me away because I didn't remember it being electronic at all. <laughs> um, so yeah, you get this cool disc with most of the letters of the alphabet. Note, they didn't put like Zs and stuff on there. Um, it is electronic. You're going to tap it. You're going to hit something. Then you're going to tap it again, pass it to the next person. So then the next one, they're going to get it. And they're like, oh, there's T. Pass it to the next person. Uh, hey. See, I don't know why sometimes it's not stopping. But there you go. Okay, stop. Stop. Okay, I don't know how to stop the tapple. So, so there you have it. Tapple unboxed. I see no reason to put this back in the box, uh, which is what I was expecting. That is a very disposable box for a reason because this holds everything you need. Um, the awesome compartment on the back for the cards that that's kick butt. I did not know that was there. So the one thing you can't fit though, is the instructions. So maybe you can fold them. I don't know what I did with them. Yeah. I'll have to figure out where I put the instructions. Uh, maybe you can fold those to fit in that back. But I think in general, once you know how to play, you know how to play. So there you have an unboxing of Tapple from USA Opoly, the op. Thank you, The Op, for uh, for letting us take a copy of this home from Origins and uh, do up a review on a, a silly puzzle game that's been out for a number of years, but one I've been wanting to play for, uh, looks like probably about 15 years since I played this. So I will be bringing this out to a local public play event. So if you happen to be in the Windsor area, uh, watch for um, watch my Facebook feed, Twitter, to find out when we're going to have local events. Uh, other than that, if you're not local, you can always find me at tabletopbellhop.com. Uh, be sure to hit the uh, subscribe, like, thumbs up, wherever you happen to be watching this. Do that thing that lets the uh, content creators like us know that you appreciate what we're doing. Um, another way you can do that is go to patreon.com slash tabletopbellhop. Uh, that's about it. You can find me, tabletopbell.com. Good day and game on.